Welcome back to Catacombs Kinda Suck. Today's catacomb is the Impaler's Catacomb here at the northeast corner of the Weeping Peninsula, and it definitely sucks. To get here, start at the Castle Morn side of Grace, and then go up the Spirit Spring. Then, continue north along the eastern cliff edge. Snag this Grace on the way if you want. I'm not even sure I knew that this was here. Killing dragonflies is not required, but it is gratifying. There's an imp that crawls up on the edge here. Give him a bonk for good luck. That is the only enemy that I even bother to fight in this entire dungeon. Once again, having a shield here really helps with the imps that throw knives. Also again, if you're the type of player that likes to level up lots of different spirit ashes, then you can grab all these flowers on your way through. I mostly just run past them. Take one step into this next room in order to trigger the trap, and then hop back and fall down under the rising floor. Grab the prattling pate, please help. This is the only item in this entire dungeon that anyone could even conceivably give a shit about. This item lets you go, please help, when you use it. Climb up this ladder to get to the boss door lever. There's an imp around the corner just waiting to ruin your day. I guess I lied earlier, I fight this guy too. And now, you fucking leave and never come back. The boss here is a burial watchdog plus four imps. It sucks. If you want to beat the boss, I would recommend using some sort of AoE incantation like Dragon Fire to take out all of the imps at once. I'm not even going to bother with that. Beating it gives you a demi-human ashes? I don't care. I got the pate. We bail. <laughs> 